it's day four of Write to the End. Welcome back. And if you're enjoying these daily writing prompts, then do check out uh, a free booklet I have on Amazon called Writing Inspirations. Uh, it's in my creative writing teacher book name, which is M. V. Franklin. So if you search for Maria Franklin, you'll get my fiction rather than my uh, uh, non-fiction. And that, that free booklet is uh, in there as well. So 125 writing prompts on everything under the sun. So uh, do enjoy that if you haven't already downloaded it. Okay, so let's have our day four uh, writing prompt. Uh, so this is a tough one, um, but I couldn't do um, a mini course, um, which where the focus is on endings without including this. So um, I've waited till you've got a, a few more prompts under your belt before throwing this one at you. So this one is to focus on end of life. Um, so this can be, as always, it can be fictional or it can be reality. Uh, it can be very therapeutic to, to write on this uh, theme, this subject uh, as well, end of life. Uh, so this could be you thinking about your own life. Um, perhaps when you get to that, that point, when you get to the end and you're looking back, how will you feel? Um, what will you uh, be proud of? Um, this can be really affirmative for you to sort of say, your stall out and everything you want to do and everything you don't want to do in uh, the the years that you've got left so this can be your own end of life this could be an end of life you've uh, been part of um, from a loved one a friend or a family member or even a pet um, it doesn't have to be another person um, so run with this these uh, three words in whichever direction they take you end of life so might be a tough one for some of you but there is no greater therapy uh, than than writing and just go with what you're comfortable with if, if it's going to be too difficult a topic for you then do write something uh, fictional um, instead but I think with prompts like this it's really great to uh, to hit them head on and uh, and and find uh, that release there's no great therapy um, than writing um, as you probably don't need, need me to tell you uh, and another thing I'm going to say just before I close the video for today and let you get on with your writing is do make sure you always carry a pen and a notebook around with you because uh, now you're in this regular cycle of writing so every day at the moment for, for 10 days uh, you never know when an idea is uh, going to uh, hit you and uh, you'll never remember it when you get home trust me so always make sure you've got paper and pen handy I'm always getting caught without either and having to put notes in my phone that really don't make a great sense to me uh, when I get home so yes paper and pen is, is a must all times they're part of the uh, the writer's toolkit um, and always be uh, eavesdropping and, and noticing we writers do notice things okay so a bit of writerly advice for day four okay so I look forward to uh, you sharing um, your writing prompts in your responses in the uh, Facebook group as always it's a it's an honour to be able to read them it's an honour to be able to lead you through this uh, course whether you're in the the Facebook group or not so do drop into the comments and say hello uh, let me know you're here because hearing from other writers is the best part of my job so I will see you tomorrow for another writing prompt and bye for now